Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're going to talk about Be Quiet Pure Loop uh, 360 AIO, which is practically the first AIO from Be Quiet on this channel, and it's going to be quite interesting because I'm really looking forward to see the performance on the 360 RAD. And of course, we have uh, three Pure Wings, uh, two 120 millimeter fans as well, all in black with the stylish brushed aluminum top, which will be, of course, magnificent to see in a build. Now, uh, I'm going to place uh, this in a bigger case, quite bigger case, but uh, let's first check out the box content. We have loads of stuff going on here, and first of all, uh, Pure Loop 360, 280, 240, and 120. You have all of these, and you can check out the prices below in the description with direct links, so you can take a look. Uh, this is some sort of um, uh, instruction manual, how to install everything, so this is something very important, read the manual. Uh, also, we have here some warranty information, and here we go. So we have one Pure Wings 2, 2 and 3, three 120 millimeter fans. This box right here is full of accessories, uh, locking nuts, uh, back plates, uh, and uh, presumably thermal paste as well, since uh, we don't have it already pre-applied on the CPU block. And finally, the main show, the main actor of this one, as well as, let's see what's this. Be quite pure loop coolant, anti-freezing to minus 5 Celsius degrees. This is really interesting since I've never, literally never seen you get a coolant inside the box. So, <laughs> this is going to be an interesting video. So, let's go. Unwrapping it, uh, you already get, I think this is a bit of a different housing when it comes to CPU block since uh, I presume this is an AMD socket, but basically I think it mounts in a complete uh, different way. And let's check out the radiator. So radiator is uh, quite uh, standard size. I think it is uh, 2.7 centimeters. And uh, we have here two cables running. One is for your pump connectivity and one is for I think this is for the LED, but we'll check that later on. Uh, of course, one more thing on the radiator, you have here a nice uh, written loop logo, uh, and it looks really cool when you place it on top. Uh, it really stands out if you have enough clearance from the top of the case. All in all, I think there's nothing left here to talk about except placing it in a nice build, uh, of course, and doing some uh, benchmarks to see the thermals and of course we're going to do it on AMD Ryzen 9 5900X. Let's just see the performance with the 360 radiator on a high core count processor. First of all this really is a big case and really a pleasure working with it because it's fully modular and you can do whatever you wish including nicely placing uh, the uh, Pure Loop 360 on top without any issues, no problem with cable management, literally just perfect. So the Be Quiet Pure Loop uh, 360 is actually quite nice and a really outstanding AIO and not just because of the looks, because I really like the minimalistic looks with the block and the Pure Loop uh, sign here on the radiator and three very quiet fans. Now, when we're talking about temperatures and how did it perform, let's start with, well, basically, the only thing that I take into consideration when stress testing the CPU uh, is IDA64 Extreme, uh, while stress testing the CPU on 100%, the temperature went to 70 Celsius degrees. I have to point out that this is AMD Ryzen 9 5900X, now next to that, uh, I also included the CPU plus FPU stress test, uh, the temperature went to 78 and while stress testing the CPU and the GPU, uh, the temperature of the CPU was 72 Celsius degrees. So I would say for 5900X 12 core 24 thread processor, the temperature is quite amazing. And I do have to say that the top and the front panel was uh, the closed one, so basically these ones were on top while testing. 
When I removed them, I got uh, after a while two, maybe three Celsius lower temperatures, and this was quite alright. So, with the front mesh and the top mesh, it was quite alright. So, guys, uh, yeah, quite interesting. Uh, first of all, build, then uh, let's say the AIO, since this is actually the first AIO from Be Quiet I tested and it performed quite nicely on the 5900X. I'll put the links below for you guys to check it out uh, because there is no reason for you not to because after all the temperatures were extremely good. It did uh, stay on 70 and it didn't move anywhere so I would say an average of 71 Celsius degrees is quite outstanding. Guys check out the links below for the Be Quiet Pure Loop 360 uh, and don't forget to comment your thoughts, click the thumbs up button and uh, subscribe for future content. Appreciate it and see you next time. Bye bye.